Chief Minister Nafirio on the first day of the two-day session at Nagaland Legislative Assembly Secretariat said that there are 9,155 primary teacher and 3,361 graduate teachers created under the state, out of which the vacant post of 249 primary teachers and 66 graduate teachers would be filled up through the department selection board. Replying to a start questions by the opposition Naga People's Front MLA Yatachu on the appointments made under the school education department, Rio stated that three graduate teachers and 40 primary teachers were appointed since March 2018 on ad hoc basis and on compassionate ground. NPF MLA Imkom L. Limcheng said that while the performance of the private and government school teachers cannot be compared, the salary components and workload is very different and the issue needs government attention. Chief Minister Rio said the proxy teachers, ghost teachers and all kinds of teachers who are not attending classes but withdrawing their salaries should be sacked. Leader of the opposition T.R. Ziliang and MLA Kuzo Luzo Nino suggested that advisors should be fully empowered to function and to answer in the House. To this, the Chief Minister replied, the Minister in charge will reply, after that any member can raise supplementary questions. Replying to a question raised by the MLA Nino, Minister of Roads and Bridges, Tongpang said the total fund allocated to restore all the district headquarters roads was rupees 25 crore with priority being given to major roads with a distance of 116.455 km. He further said the department is taking up the work district wise. Deputy Chief Minister Wai Paton, who also holds the home portfolio on the issue of influx of illegal immigrants, said the administration and police in the district are making periodic checks. The session started with obituary references by the Chief Minister and the Leader of Opposition on the passing away of former Prime Minister Atal Bihari Wajpay and former Lok Sabha Speaker Somnath Chetaji. The member also observed a two-minute silence to pay their respect to the departed souls. With Inzanbe Mukhuvo, APN Kohima.